Hey guys, uh, today we'll be talking about how to troubleshoot a circuit breaker in your service panel. Uh, first, I'm going to show you the three different positions in your circuit breaker toggle switch. This is the toggle. So, pretty much, obviously, uh, there's at least two positions actually there's three positions in your circuit breaker this is G breaker you have the off position you have the on position for instance these all these breakers right now if you really look they're in on position so there should be power going to feed all the circuits right now and sometimes when you have a trip breaker sometimes it does look like it's on for instance we have a two pole breaker two pole breakers that means it has a it's a 220 amp uh, 220 volt breaker so this right here see it's not all the way in on position it's actually tripped position so the way you reset the trip breaker you have to uh, pull the breaker put the breaker in off position first and once you lock that breaker in off position you'll be able to reset it and turn it back on now I'm gonna show you for instance if you um, reset the breaker and the breaker is in on position but you still have no power going to your receptacle or to your appliances uh, this is how you test the breaker to make sure you don't have a faulty breaker uh, what you're gonna need is a multimeter and obviously the two leads the, sir, uh, the panel has grounding see this is a grounding log and how do you test the breaker is up, up, uh, putting one lead to the ground I'm just doing this with one hand so bear with me and apply the second lead actually you gotta put the black one to the ground and the red one to the hot side of the breaker I need a tripod for this and by applying the two leads one to the ground and one to the breaker you think it's faulty you can check the reading right now it's uh, giving it's putting out 123 volts so that tells me the breaker is good and if you still have no power to your circuit for instance to your switch or to your outlet you should be looking at uh, possibly broken wire uh, bad outlet or bad switch uh, that's how you check the circuit breaker and also what you can check if you check and you don't get the power with your multimeter what you should check for connections sometimes these breakers this is a, a snap-on breaker pretty much you put this uh, on the back panel and you uh, latch it and then you snap it in sometimes you could have a burn connection right here in the breaker or in the ba bus bar or sometimes the breakers they come with the screw right here that screws into your back plate sometimes the screw they can come loose and you're not gonna have a good connection so you should definitely uh, check that also this video is only for education purposes if you have a problem get 
get a hold of your local electrician that can assist you solving the problem. Thanks for watching guys.